From the Washington Times, I'm Tim Constantine. Car maker Stellantis and tech giant Samsung SDI have announced plans to build another electric vehicle battery factory in Kokomo, Indiana, where unionized workers dread them. The companies said they will invest $3.2 billion to build the plant, and the facility is expected to open in 2027 and employ 1,400 new jobs. Unionized car workers, however, think the plant is a potential threat to their job security. Many auto employees represented by the United Auto Workers work in factories building transmissions and gasoline-powered engines, things that will be obsolete in a fully electric auto industry. Ford, General Motors, and Stellantis, who manufactures Chrysler cars, have made it their mission to get in on the EV boom. Stellantis wants EV to make up at least 50% of its sales in the United States by 2030. Tech giant Google wants to make passwords a thing of the past. The company wants to replace passwords with pass keys, technology that includes fingerprinting, facial recognition, or a PIN number. In a blog post last week, the company affirmed that pass keys are more efficient and more secure. We have found that one of the more immediate benefits of pass keys is that they spare people of the headache of remembering all those numbers and special characters in passwords, the blog post reads. Users still will be able to use a traditional password if they prefer by disabling their account's skip password when possible option. Passkeys have become much more popular as cybersecurity becomes a key concern. The iPhone lets users apply passkeys across all Apple apps. Google and Android mobile devices also allow for the cross-app passkey usage. For these stories and all the news, visit us at WashingtonTimes.com.